can enjoy yourselves. Uh, we have things handled here. Yes. Any nightmares, bogeymen, or monsters under the bed will be dealt with swiftly and fairly. In an impartial court. <laughs> Keep talking, I just might. So, uh, there's not many secret spots, even on grounds this big. But this one, special. Wow, that's beautiful. You played it there? Yeah. It's a moonflower. Bloody hard to grow in England. Yeah, but... Worth it. Is it? Is it? This plant only blooms two months a year, but only at night. Each bud only once. Its flowers will be dead by morning. And tomorrow night, new buds will bloom and then they'll die. In three weeks, this entire plant will be dead. And in the spring, I'll have to plant a whole new moonflower. It's a lot of work for a flower that only blooms once. It's what people feel like to me. Exhaustive effort. Very little straightforward. All of them? All of them. Even you. Even me. Especially me. So, I figured I'd save you some effort. to the end. Big shot. Why not? Here you go, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. When was Louise? That was Dennis. Dennis met Louise when she was 18. He was 24. Total surprise. Here later, my brother, Denny. And me. That's a surprise, I guess. Dad starts working in a coal mine. It's uh, more money. Slightly more. But he's barely home now. And Louise, well, Louise is home with the kids. And she's basically a kid herself. Kid with two kids and her husband 600 metres down. So she does what kids do. She plays. So dad's underground and mum's under some bloke and the thing about a coal mine but the thing I think about most now I'm older no plants down there no life at all see these men we send them down into this dark mess digging for something dead so dead that it's now lumps of dead things so old and lifeless that they will literally burn and that was his life while she did whatever she could to feel alive all that death that dark powdery death is all over his face his hands and his fucking lungs when he comes up there's not a leaf not a branch not a flower in his world and when he finally climbs out of that grave finally climbs back to the land of the living because the whole town knows that the new baby, my little brother Mikey, isn't his. So Dennis buries his head in the soot and they praise him for his loyalty or they mock him for a cuckold. Louise, on the other hand, call a spade a spade and they call him a mum a whore. Call a daughter open too at school, on the streets, even makes his way home. Little Denny piles on, tries to save his own skin by blaming all the females in the family. And in 67, Louise bolts. She splits. And I come home from school to find Mikey. Alone. Screaming his little head off. 
he's still a baby and he doesn't understand what he's done wrong. I try and take care of him. I'm just a kid. Kids can't raise kids. They forget things. I watch over a pot when it boils. Social services gets involved and we split up. Dad did his best. He spent so long underground, he didn't know what to do with a kid, let alone three kids. So he disappeared into the dirt. And it was foster care. Just a bunch of stale, perverted men and bitter wives, hoping to make a few quid by taking care of the local trash. in a couple of years. And it's there I start gardening. Busy work for idle hands. I fucking love it. Love it. And it's so clear then how oh, people aren't worth it. But plants. You pour your love and your effort and your nourishment into them. and go. No one makes sense. So yeah. <laughs> Everyone is exhaustive. Even the best ones. Sometimes, it's in a blue goddamn moon, I guess. Someone, like this moonflower, just might be worth the effort. and who doesn't. Sorry, Danny, but you don't. Humans are organic. It's a fact. We're meant to die. It's natural. Beautiful. And it all breaks down and rises back up and breaks down again and every living thing grows out of every dying thing. They leave more life behind us to take our place. Refreshes, recycles, and on and on it goes. And that is so much better than that life getting crushed deep down in the dirt to a rock that will burn if it's old enough. So much better to see the leafling flower. We leave more life behind to take our place. Like this moonflower. Well, it's beauty, Elijah.